<clears throat> okay guys, it's Michelle. I'm back. Uh, Grateful Creations. I'm doing another uh, pearl cloud straight pour, ring pour, whatever you want to call it. It's a 20 by 20 gallery wrapped canvas. It's been pinned, taped, and sprayed. So um, I've changed up the colors a little bit. This is actually champagne mixed with um, pearl white. And I actually put a little tiny bit of the satin enamels in here. And then the rest of the colors are pretty much the same. This is Sleeping Beauty and I mixed it with Blue Eyes uh, from TLP. So those are the only differences. Um, I do have the 24 karat gold. Da -da -da. And um, this is the Artist Loft Metallic Cobalt Blue. Golden Green Gold. I might be mixed a little bit with some Liquitex um, lime green. And this is the Prussian blue and uh, Payne's gray mix. <clears throat> so we're going to do it again. And I like the results last time. Um, I don't know how it's going to work out on a big, bigger canvas, but we're going to try it. And I'm using a little bit bigger cup than I did. If this is a nine ounce cup, but I'm not going to fill it up. Um, I do, I liked the way it was a gradient. And um, so here we go. That is the pearl. Here's the gold. I thought, I thunk, I thought there was a little bit too much gold last time. So hopefully I'm not gonna put that much gold in this time. There's the Sleeping Beauty and Blue Eyes. Now this TLP pinwheel, I mixed it with uh, another purple that I had hanging around and I'm not sure what color that was. A little bit more of the pearl. Then we're gonna go with the cobalt, metallic cobalt blue. Green gold and paint's gray. Oh, it's almost a full cup. <clears throat> Shoo! This will be interesting. I always get nervous just before I pour, but uh, I don't know why, you know. It's just paint. So here we go down my deco art satin enamel mix and let me put this cup over here so I don't tip it over I did paint the sides with some Artist Loft Flow White. So I would get um, the sides to stick. And down to that corner. Go, 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 go. It's gonna go. Almost. I'm just going to make sure I've got all my sides covered here. It helps the paint flow better. Oh, this side is not covered. <gasps> I like to have a, a lot of artists just put it in the center and then tip it off later. I like to have all my sides covered. There we go. It's covered now. And so is my arms. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh my. All right. So that is done. Let me just tip it to make sure that I don't have too much paint on it. See right there. And I 
do. That could have been tragic. All right, I'll wipe my hands off real quick. And we're going to pour. And I'm going to start up top. Now, do I want to do it? Do I want to have negative space? Maybe I'll do it down here, stretch it out this way and then have some negative space up at the, at the top. They're very thin paints. for a minute actually see if it develops at all um, this is really quite interesting <laughs> I'm almost wondering if I can keep some of the composition I'm gonna get my <laughs> arm off yeah when you get paint on anything best thing to do is to get wipe it off as soon as possible um, Look at that. Wow. I'm just going to let it sit for a minute or two. Do, 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 do. Because they're really thin paints, we're not going to be able to keep that composition, keep those lines at all, because it's the paints are way too thin. So we know that in advance. And that's okay. Um, what do I like the most? It's funny because all the blue, the dark deep blue came out over there. And that's the stuff I really need to tip off. But, um, crap. Maybe I can go. I don't know what I'm doing. I'll be honest, I don't know what I'm doing. The blue eyes is kind of cool in there though. Uh, it seems it's almost painful to wreck this, but um, can't keep it like this either. So I'm just lots of paint underneath here. I'm just gonna, I'm stalling. <laughs> it's painfully obvious, isn't it? I'm stalling. <laughs> All right, guys, here we go. I don't know if we can keep any of the composition. It would be cool if we could. Let's take it down. Uh, I want more of that gold off. There we go. Stretch, stretch, stretch. looking weirdo lines. this way now. Almost looks like a, a beach. Not what I was intending, but hey, I'll take it. Still a little 
move in, move in, move in, move in. I'm gonna do that vertical tilt. Whoa, Wilbur. Yeah, there's still lots of paint on here. Composition's gonna be kind of cool. take all these wonky cells off from the bottom and then pull it back again and maybe get some more cells again. isn't a ring pour anymore. <laughs> too much paint. Once again, too much paint, but we'll deal with it. Um, we'll see what happens. Um, yeah, it would have been better if the navy blue, and that might sell all up too. So, um, the Prussian blue, the king's gray, if that would have been tilted off, but like I said, I might get a lot of cells coming from that anyway. Uh, we'll see. And if not, we can always report. I'm gonna put you guys on time lapse. Let me see, I wanna get you nice and straight here for a change. <laughs> I don't know. Never seems to be straight. All right, I'm gonna put you on time lapse. I'll be back.
well, I don't think those are pearls. I think they're boulders. <laughs> I've never seen anything so big in all my life. And I was worried that I might not get anything. Psh. Um, yeah. I, you know, the straight pour didn't do anything as far as composition, but the colors are kind of cool. I blew on some of this over here and it created some more cells, which is kind of cool. I like that. Um, yeah, it's still too much gold. Um, I gotta bring that in. Um, these are some pretty darn nice colors. So these, um, they're like ghost cells. There's a ton up here in the corner. That's because we stretched it right there. And they're cool. Oh, I think I see a couple of dust bunnies here. But um, I'm really liking that TLP in Pinwheel. Once again, it's becoming a favorite. And the blue eyes is kind of showing up too with the Sleeping Beauty. I don't know how these cells are gonna pan out in the morning. Um, it's okay. I'm not sure. I mean, it's one of the things I really love about it. Sorry, <laughs> didn't mean to make you dizzy. So a lot of these lines are natural. I've created a couple of them coming up this way, but for the most part, they're natural. And I really like the cells and the, the blue peeking through here. That's really cool. So, anyhow, let me know what you guys think. Please be safe and create. Please like, share, and subscribe. And ciao for now.